Shit. It was a white guy, too. I'm dying. I am. Uh, all hell, rap motherfuckers get back, store rails. Kick back with a six pack, yeah, we gon' do what he want, leave another zip pound. A podcast levels far beyond that. This ain't no bullshit, it's marsh pits and all that. Real talk for the steel got tasted. Rat stick, spill cheers on your faces. Gone ape shit, blaze it and take it in. Rat talks with crack rocks and gin. Metalheads unite with a grin. Goddamn master man, that's real shit now. To open up your mind to smoke a bowl. A bunch of heads getting stoned, you know how it go. It's the new show on the block. 100% uncut rock top. top. Yeah, you know what that song means. It's another episode of Rat Talk. And have I got a surprise for you guys. Mm. My very first uh, returning guest today are the Gargoyles. What up, guys? What up? Yo. So Johnny, David, and then we actually have Scott in this time. Yay! Barely. Yeah. <laughs> How's your hand, buddy? Pretty good. Not yeah. better yet, but... <laughs> better? I can still use it in the bathroom. Ah, see? There you go. That's all that matters, in my opinion. But how's it going, fellas? How's the life been treating you since uh, the episode? Nothing's changed. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's changed. <laughs> well, you've obviously played more shows. We like have, it, yeah, because I think when you when you were in here, you were about to play your first show. No, or your second, something like that. No, what what show? <laughs> what show was that? No, that was the acoustic one. It was our first acoustic set. That's oh what that yeah, was. yeah, yeah, you're right. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. That's what it was. Yeah, I'm being a dick. Yeah, see, you fucking asshole. Fuck. You put the sunglasses on. Goodbye. And you, think you're, you think you're God all of a sudden? <laughs> 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 okay, but uh, so that was your first acoustic set. How many how many shows have you done since then? So that was the, we have the acoustic set. You did uh, a show at the Silver Dollar. Probably about four. Four in total. Yeah, I think it was four. Yeah, four in total. Mm-hmm. How long was, when was the acoustic show? The acoustic show was about... In July, I think. Yeah, I was going to say about... Oh, okay. Yeah. It wasn't even that long. Two months. That's not bad. Yeah. Like Four shows in two months? Twice a month. There you go. Our bi-weekly show. <laughs> it's like child support. We were doing it for like three weeks in a row, I think. Yeah, we were playing... Um, Sometimes... We were playing like every week almost for a little while. Yeah. It was like one show a week for like a month at least. Yeah. Yeah. What were Almost. uh what w- not what were the shows but uh well yeah, what 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 shows were they? Cuz I know you did the Silver Dollar, you had that acoustic set, you had uh you did one with Ryan D and we actually Wait. had one on a Thursday before the Ryan D show at in Burbank. Yeah, that's right. That's the one I'm thinking of. What was that? Uh, Jimmy's place. Where was that one at? Yeah. At Burbank. Jimmy's, Jimmy's, Jimmy's place. place. Yes. In Burbank. It was pretty dead. Was it, uh, was it awesome? Pretty like, dead. Was it a pretty cool? It was a band practice. <laughs> yeah. 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 As cool. bad as the Ryan show? Um, the There was less people. Uh, it was pretty bad, dude. It was less people less, than the Ryan show? Less There's people. Probably one, two, three, four. Five. No. There was only two patrons and the bartender. And then the remaining people were band members. Uh, that's it yeah okay so at least someone stayed around and supported you guys they uh, left like halfway through our set like the two patrons really? they were like oh what dicks fuck them then fuck that place no i'm just kidding it's far was it, i mean was it a cool place at least like was the promoter cool and yeah dude the ac was fucking blasting <laughs> <laughs> and the was sound was actually really fucking good i like okay that. yeah the sound good was sound good. yeah mm-hmm. it was good sound better but than the silver dollar for sure silver oh, dollar yeah. always cracks <laughs> But yeah, Silver Dollar does always crack. I, always. I went to that show. That show was fucking pretty cool. They always crack. Yeah, I feel like you guys should have headlined that one. But some things you got to do in the music yeah. industry to get yourself noticed. <clears throat> yeah, we sometimes you got to be second in order to be first. Yeah, we <laughs> <laughs> we've been wanting to. I'd like to co-headline instead of headline, um, just because I just feel there's less pressure, I guess. That makes sense. Yeah. But D- I mean, do you guys always get nervous before hopping up on stage? No. I just get like super excited and like I mm-hmm. try to chill out so Get a little much. tingly in the balls? Kinda, yeah. <laughs> David David's seen it. I get so weird. Like 
I'm just like focus mode. Like I don't, I don't want to mm-hmm. talk to nobody. Just give me my guitar. Let me do that already. Like, <laughs> that sounds like the most unexcited, exciting <laughs> person. <though. laughs> no, I want to. Yeah, I just get super quiet and really focused. <laughs> And right. I'm just so excited to be to, to be doing on on stage. <laughs> well, last time you guys were here, I obviously had uh, Johnny and David talk about how long they've been playing, and unfortunately, I did not get to ask you that, Scott. So, tell us the story of Scott real quick, the the legend himself that nobody got to hear of last time. <laughs> <laughs> we have a podcast solo with Scott today. Yeah, solo that shit. <laughs> well, you guys are going to be performing an acoustic set, a whole set this time, which is going to be. Pretty awesome. We hope you guys enjoy it. I hope so too, because maybe somebody will get you on some more shows. <laughs> 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 I had no response for that. Yeah. I'm sorry. I was like, maybe wishful thinking. Yeah, exactly. Wishful Love us. Thinking. Uh, but Scott, yeah, back to you. Um, let me see. I mean, I've always had Start with your name. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Scott. I play guitar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've always had, like, instruments around me since mm-hmm. I was little, like at my grandpa's house. So, and then when I grew up, I didn't give a fuck about it. I just, you know, wanted to fucking run around and cause hav- havoc everywhere. But <laughs> but then it started at Be school. A it started at school. Like, uh, the music class was, was at the end of the day. So it was after lunch, and it was, like, music class. And then you had a choice to to do it or not, and then I was like, "Oh, why not?" Because at the end of the day, <laughs> then you just fucking go home right yeah. after. It's like a push up. <laughs> <laughs> should I do it or should I not do it? <laughs> fuck. Yeah. So it started like that, and then like I don't give a fuck about the music. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> at, at that sure. time, all right. <laughs> fuck the music. Fuck the music. And then it just got like it just got me like. Well, I mean, what was the music that you're? Oh, I, I first started like I first started off with the clarinet. Nice. And then when I went to middle school, I started off playing drums. I was like, I'm, I, was okay. like I was like, clarinet's kind of like you know. So you didn't even start off with guitar. You no, just, you he was a Squidward. Guitar. Yeah. <laughs> 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 so I started playing drums, and then it, it went out through high school, and then like during high school, I was my grandpa was trying to teach me the guitar too, but I didn't want I didn't I didn't want to play what he was playing, trying to teach me. So I just dropped the guitar, and then mm. um, I went to drums. And then from the drums, I went to the bass. And so I was playing jazz band at school and stuff. Just playing fucking everything, pretty much. <laughs> I'm trying. Yeah. And I then mean, because that's what these yeah. guys were saying last time, too, is like all of you played, played, started off with different instruments and then just, you know, happened to end up where you guys are at now. Like, yeah. Because you said you started with guitar, right? Yes. Yeah. And then you did also, too, right? Or no, you did you start with drums? I started with guitar as with well. With guitar. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, yeah. I mean, whatever instrument I had at the And then house. you guys, yeah, then Squidward, <laughs> and then Squidward <laughs> over here. Squidward. <laughs> Start off with the clarinet. That's I'm fucking so a, boring. Yeah, that's so awesome, I though. I could have been, <laughs> been the next Kenny G, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Oh, shit. Oh, <laughs> Kenny <fuck>. C. Yeah. <laughs> Kenny C. <laughs> <laughs> it's Scotty C, huh? Uh, oh, Scotty man. C. <clears throat> Get that success perm. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> dude, I'm... So, w- w- when did you really pick up the guitar, then? <laughs> okay, so... Like seriously, I guess I don't know. Like a couple years ago, then, because like I wasn't really serious with the guitar mm-hmm. before. I was just you know dabbling like and power well, chords. Because you shit. said uh, by middle school you you're already multi instrument talented. And uh, have you been in bands like r- in middle school or when did you start? No, not in middle school. I started. I was in a band. My first band was in um, probably when I was a sophomore. And w- were you playing guitar at that point? No, I was playing no. bass at that one. Oh, okay. It was pretty cool. Uh, wh- what did I play? I was playing bass. We were playing like, like kind of like misfit stuff, and we had we Covers? had some uh, some originals, but like it was mostly misfit stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was cool. How many bands have you been in, uh, including this one? This is three. This is my third band. Oh shit! Yeah, I mean, I've been I, I jam out with like everybody. Yeah. Because everybody fucking knows you. Like, yeah, I'll jam out with anybody. You just walked inside and you happen to know some. <laughs> <laughs> it's so Thanks, Scott. You, yeah, you walk in there, that guy. He's like the most preppiest person. Like he's <laughs> he's got a nice shirt on. Well, a little more nicer than that one. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> he's got like uh, he's like all in business attire and he's all Scott. Like he's <laughs> like the most un like unsuspecting person you would think that you would know. Yeah, sneaky, we went, sneaky, we went to school together. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, he was telling me. Fucking Arroyo, man. Everybody goes to that school. 
Only the cool people go to that school. <laughs> Even the cooler people get kicked out. <laughs> go to Bali. <clears throat> uh, so this is your third. What was the second band? Uh, it was Death Valley Saints. This is like an alternative kind of band. Wh- wh- what was it? Death Valley Saints? Yeah. Hmm. I think I've heard that name tossed around when I was in middle school. No, we weren't. Says that. everybody that hears Valley. that name. It's like I mean, a it's such football a team or name. something. Yeah. Like football team. Football Death team? Valley Death Saints. Valley Saints. Yeah. Arena <laughs> football. It could, be, it could be a movie, too. Death Valley Saints versus <laughs> Kiss. Versus Kiss. Kiss <laughs> football. <laughs> Are they doing that right now? LA, is it LA Kiss? It is LA Kiss. LA Kiss versus mm-hmm. the Death Valley Saints. I haven't seen shit about that. Out of Death Valley. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, everyone would, everybody would ask me, why do you guys have that name? You guys from Death Valley? I was like, no, I didn't fucking pick the name, man. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I just play bass. Yeah, I'm just in the band. Did you write the music for uh, your own music? Yeah, a lot of it. Oh, wait, for that band, right? Yeah, for that yeah, band. Yeah, I did. I helped out a lot. Okay. I mean, d- did you write other people's parts or you just wrote yeah. your own your own bass parts? Um, I, did, I, I mean, I would try to throw it in there, but, you mm. know, they'd be like, no, I don't want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> try to give uh, your own opinion and get shot down. How nice. With a sarcastic. <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> and then, uh, obviously, now you've got this band, the Gargoyles. How did, how did you uh, decide that these were the guys? I um, guess. <laughs> we showed up. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> we kept showing up. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Dedication. Mm-hmm. That's all we need. Yeah, because I had, I bought I like, I was like fuck it I'm gonna buy all these equipment so I bought all this shit and then I was like, well, who the fuck am I gonna play with? <laughs> <laughs> and then I was like, hmm, who that's the fuck that's plays? Yeah. probably the best thing is just like yeah I'm gonna get all this stuff and then once you got it you're just like oh shit like it's just me exactly dude I was <clears> like, fuck and so he was your first call yeah nice I was Man. yeah. How sweet. I think he's just saying that. <laughs> he is, too. <laughs> no, but that's awesome. And then you obviously brought along David as well. I or did did you call David, too? I drug his no. ass along. Yeah. I was like, come play drums for us. <laughs> and you already knew Scott, too. But that, I mean, obviously, everybody knows fucking Scott. I knew yeah. of him, yeah. I didn't know him. I knew of oh, okay. I, I just seen him and seen pictures of him. <laughs> and you knew like, him, but you didn't know him. Yeah. yeah. I was okay. just I, was I don't like even know myself. <laughs> You're a legend, dude. Every everybody knows who you are, but nobody knows who you are. The like bangs. Bigfoot. <laughs> yeah, it was the bangs actually. It was the bangs. No, it was the bangs. Mm-hmm. Everyone was like, Oh, you're you're the guy with the long bangs. I'm like, yeah, I guess. <laughs> I like your bangs. Uh, the, the purple bangs. Nice. Well, I love the Brian Johnson you look you got going on instead. <laughs> like a work shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, though. <clears throat> All right. Well, I want to get to the reason why you guys came down here, and that was to play some fucking music. Good music to that fact, which I feel like is missing from the world. Fuckers. Yeah. So fuck everybody. You're going to listen to what I like. <laughs> <laughs> Um, tell us a little bit about, well, uh, tell us about the set. Like, uh, I think we're just going to wing it. We're going to take you guys through a psychedelic adventure (coughs) that we composed ourselves and we designed it as a concept. (laughs) No, we're just going to play a couple (laughs) fucking songs for you. It's a good thing that I just, that, that acid is kicking in now. So I think it'll be amazing. It's a book within a book (laughs) that you listen to. All right. But everybody... Strap on your seatbelts because you're about to hear some magic. This is the Gargoyles coming out of uh, where are you guys coming out of San Gabriel? Because we'll do Almani, we'll do Almani, Rep Almani, Rep yeah. Monte. Yeah. All right, S-G-G. fuck yeah, there you go. It's the Gargoyles out of El Monte, California. Mm. Hold on to your shit because it's about to explode. Hold on to it. <laughs> <coughs> Let's just piss one more time. Yeah, go for it. They don't want to cross the strings, but I gotta cross the strings.
too Don't mess with him cause he'll come after you He's Big Joe He's Big Joe
right, that was the fucking Gargoyles rocking in here at uh, Homecast Studio. Thank you guys so much for coming in. You can follow them at uh, the Gargoyles Band on Instagram. Uh, is it the same on Facebook as well? It's the Gargoyles Band on Instagram and Gargoyles the Band on Facebook. I think. Gargoyles the Band on Facebook. I think so. Uh, thank you guys so much again for coming in. You can follow Rat Talk on Twitter uh, no. at Rat Talk, Facebook at Rat Talk, and uh, Instagram Rat underscore Talk. Uh, also give David Salazar tattoo a follow. Shout out to him. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Thank you guys for rocking it here on Rat Talk, and I hope you folks at home enjoyed it. Thank you very much. <laughs>